and welcome back to the next episode of Game of Thrones and my reaction. I am really, really enjoying this series so far and the last episode was brilliant that the Hound's back. I cannot wait to get into this now. The episode's called No One. No One. And I've got a feeling, well obviously I've got to know what it's about, but it's already like putting ideas into my head. I think it may have something to do with Arya. I'm not sure. Uh, okay, so yeah, I'm just gonna get right into this. Uh, here we go. Oh shit! <laughs> it's not even been into it about a minute already, and already I'm nervous. Okay, I didn't expect that. This makes me happy. And on the back of the lady's head, okay? Right hand holds the small of the lady's back like so. Very romantic. Take your middle finger, yeah? And you jab it right off her bone hole! <laughs> <laughs> so fucking close! <laughs> oh, it smells like pussy to me. Look at him! You go! You're fucking... He seems to be. I'm gonna pause it. Bron seems to be like one of those guys that looks and sounds like he doesn't give a shit. But actually, watching it through the things that he does, he genuinely cares about people. Now he didn't have to do that. Bron's going on. I want more Bron. Carry on. He's not gonna take it. You gave it to me for a purpose. I've achieved that purpose. yours. It'll always be yours. Got ghostbobs, guys. <laughs> One last thing, Sir Jamie. Yes, Lady Brienne. Should I fail to persuade the Blackfish to surrender? And if you attack the castle? Honor compels me to fight for Sansa's kin. Of course it does. To fight you. Let's hope it doesn't come to that. Oh. Two translators are on a sinking ship. The first says, Do you know how to swim? The second says, No, but I can shout for help in 19 languages. <laughs> <laughs> that is the worst joke I ever heard. <laughs> I'm a soldier all my life. You think I never hear a joke? You lie. 
invite you, lass. I make joke. <laughs> More jokes. Okay. I once walked into a brothel with a honeycomb and a jackass. The madam says. Oh, for God's sake, I really enjoyed that scene. There's always something to ruin it. Oh, shit. The masters have come for their property. Just never enjoy a scene in Game of Thrones. That's basically rule number one. We found the blackfish, my lord. Good. Bring him to me. He died fighting, my lord. Now did it because it didn't show it. And when it doesn't show deaths, they're not dead. We all remember the hound. That is a really, really cool shot. That shot is amazing. I don't like what's happening. <laughs> oh dear. Goosebumps again. This episode's brilliant. No. I am still watching. Eddie Crane. Oh no. <laughs> I don't like this. Don't Eddie like Crane? this at all. Oh! If you'd have done your job, she would have died painlessly. Oh, no, 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 no. The many faced God was promised a name. He must always receive what is his. You can't change that. I can't change that. No one can. And now he's been promised another name. You can't keep running forever, are you? Oh. <laughs> I'm sweating, I'm tired. Please, for God's sake, if Arya dies, I'm going to be so mad. I mean, I'm sure she doesn't. I'm sure she doesn't, but... Ew! I liked her better when she was in Doctor Who. She was nice then. So fucking tense right now. Whoa! Whoa! And I'm going home.
Yeah. I'm so sure she was going to stab me, but yes. <laughs> but teach yourself to never be happy during Game of Thrones. Very, very good. Really enjoyed that episode. That was such a tense final 10 minutes, can I tell you that? Wow. Um, okay, so what to make of that? One of the best scenes of that episode was, without a doubt, the little drunk scene where everything was literally so happy and then all of a sudden it just flipped it to the other side, which Game of Thrones does tend to do a lot. Uh, I'm really excited for the next one. Now, I will go into that now because when I first started watching series one of Game of Thrones, um, or at least when I started filming the reactions for it, I knew that Battle of the Bastards was the big one, and I know that's the next episode because I've got the DVD. So I knew it was series six, episode nine. I have no fucking idea what's gonna happen, and I'm so tense, so nervous for it because it's it's just talked about constantly by friends, and it's on the top spot of IMBD or whatever. Uh, really excited. I think I might actually film the next episode maybe tomorrow um yeah uh i'm so happy that i am still alive like i'm literally so sweating um yeah so until next time i'm hoping that the next episode of game of thrones will be posted a week today i'm gonna try and make it every thursday if i can uh that'd be nice so yes um i'm gonna i'm gonna take five minutes and process everything yeah until next time See you later. She can't work this. I can't. Why not? But feeling you'd be good at this sort of work. And besides, we need a new actress.